see you. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Happy Mother's Day. Are you being mean to me? <laughs> what are you doing? Yeah. I'll so stay we'll off the cigarettes. <laughs> One more for the road, buddy. <laughs> Come on. All right, well, we got rid of the fan family there. Freaking had a nice visit. Freaking, uh, I don't know. Freaking pushed record and uh, camera was frozen. So don't even know if I recorded anything. Sweet. But anyways, we'll get back on this uh, nonsense here. I got the one... Uh, the one plunger, so I'll just make another one same. What do you think of the light, boys, eh? Oh, just missed him. See that? He was on here, and I was just walking up, and and he quit. What's really going on for your pant antler? No, I did not. Oh man, I'm usually really careful with those and I'm like, oh, it's just the cup ears and crunch. Mm -hmm. I hear you. So I've wrecked one bit, so I'm gonna just wreck another bit here. Yeah, there she goes. Fuck. Didn't want to lose any length for fuck's sakes, but I might have to. I think your microphone's finger fucked. Where are you finger fucking it? It's probably filled with cheese. Anything is possible. Try to push the end yeah. of it in her mouth. Telling her to open up and stuff like that. <laughs> how much a sound to be, how much a sound to be. Because they had to put her in a home. So they took his took a diaper off. Ate the Tootsie Roll. You're Tootsie Rolling up your mom's ass? <laughs> <laughs> oh fuck. Oh, for fuck's sakes, Robus, I knocked over my suckler box. Good job. For fuck's sakes! <laughs> Bend this back down you fucked it up. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the heel. Oh, oh. the butthole. Awful. Okay. The butthole nugget. Maybe the pointy pisser tip. Maybe the mushroom. Just wait. Just wait. Oh, do you want to finish off the, the dirty piece? chunk of the meat cigarette? Here, take a bite. Take a bite off Robus's tip. Oh, do you got the wet heaves? Oh, it just plunges her home. No. Wow. <clears throat> oh, give me the old <laughs> nutcracker. Decent. Oh, boys, we're going to walk the shit, monks. We'll be back in a second. Sounds good. Don't do anything. Don't do a Mexican hand puppet. Whatever you do. Hey, seriously. It's terrible. Oh, man, I got a June bug or something down my neck. Hey, you get in the back. Get in the back. We'll go for a ride. Come on. Come on. Can I park it in your driveway? Oh, lady. Oh, Machi Machi? Okay, choo choo. Okay. We'll see you later. Smoke cigarettes. Oh, Jack. There's trouble. He's after my beams. You're after my beams. Hey, you're right. <laughs> but I do have a couple of things to throw in the next one. Decent. Oh, you got a drill, doctor? Yeah. I don't know where the other part is. But anyway, they're all yours. Decent. Thank you. Hmm. Yeah, that bit holds the drill and then. Give her a try. You know, Thank you. I have been literally looking on fucking Kijiji for that exact, for thing. That exact thing. Are you serious? Yes. Good rock, good rock, not a good rock. That, that right there. Oh, beer can, good rock, good rock, beer can, bottle yeah. can, fucking bottle, bottle, can, can. <laughs> bottle, bottle, can, can, take your butt, good. Oh, bottle, 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 Winch battery. Uh. Well, we got the call, boys. Guy messed with 
me on Facebook. He says, uh, oh, you might want to be interested in this. So Kijiji, somebody uh, giving away their rig there. So friggin' uh, messed them and loving things after another. We're, uh, we're going to get it. So much obliged, Priest Tory Bell. Big, big fan. Just, uh, and it's a Mazda Tribute. We got Mazda Tribute rims. The guy doesn't want to give away his rims and tires because free and free, free situation we're dealing with. So, freaking rates, boys. Just grab those bastards and uh, we'll be off. All this guy shit taking his truck. <laughs> That's enough. There's only one key, and I went to go replace it because it's like that. And they told me at the dealership was 250 bucks. So you I don't want to replace it. Nope. Thank you. All right. Go out there. There she goes. Go on. Yeah. <laughs> Friggin' decent. So I got 262,000 kilometers on it. Right. Just gunning her. How did you make out friggin' Robbis? How did you make it? You're like a trailer towing supervising yeah, helper. I'm a foreman. Yeah. You're like a foreskin. Buddy. What? What? Okay, go west. <laughs> that was hilarious. Holy fuck. Is this gonna crash into the ride? He doesn't even give a shit. He's like, I don't give a fuck, but if I die, I die. <laughs> oh fuck. That's funny as fuck, is he saw us fucking way back there and he was like waiting and I kind of made eye contact with him and fucking he catches up and Why my life back off? Yeah. <laughs> oh I got a fucking pick, buddy. Yeah, so friggin' uh, picked this guy up for free, but uh, I bought uh, the tires that I had off the other Mazda that I had. And uh, she said she'd uh, get rid of these for 200 bucks. And worst case, Ontario, where the old lady's van needs uh, new tires. So friggin' right, it's friggin' almost new friggin' snow tires. Look at those sons of bitches. For 200 bucks, I'll put them on, on for sales right now for 400. And uh, yeah, good battery. Friggin' uh, 2017 for frick's sakes. That's ridiculous. So, yeah, totally scores. Aluminum rims, good battery. I mean, running, driving, freaking vehicle. It's not even, it's not even that bad. There's a little bit of rust on the, on the guy, but I mean, look what we're doing in the shop. Put a little poop in there, a little spray paint. Be a good, uh, good little, good little rig for somebody probably. Figure out the O2 sensor or whatever it is that's wrong with it. Sputtering and carrying on. Can't be much. Can't be much. But, uh, any words. Piece of chat. What?
Yeah, it looks garbage. Oh, you could totally sharpen the shit out of that. That's fire. But he just dropped it off for free. Yeah, and free. I was absolutely looking for one of these on Kijiji weeks ago and then gave up because, you know, expensive. Yeah, eh? Piece of chat. Expensive, terrible. That one's fucking free. I got a free friggin' drill doctor, and I must attribute, and I'm not even a mother, on mother word. So I just got on the Facebook there, friggin' gave, uh, gave Shane the old thanks there, friggin' rates. I picked up that uh, Mazda he uh, mentioned, uh, mentioned on the Facebook there, and he friggin' uh, shot me a message on Facebook, says, oh, check this out, oh, and I checked it out, it just happened to be there, we were sitting at the desk. The old thing, damnly, and friggin', uh, I'll check this out, and do to do. Next thing you know, we're going to get the sun, bitch. So, friggin' rights for that. Mucho gracias, your skull. Pretty sure, ah, wide open. Oh, that's how much or something, something terrible. And when we come back, we took Robert's for a dirty old uh, golf ride, and this one dick that stopped by to look at the beams one time, and then I ran into him at uh, the TSC the other day, and then he's swinging by with a friggin' drill doctor. I think what happened was the diamond wheel had slid off the shaft, eh? So it was it was protruding out further than uh, copacetic, so I just undid it, slid her back on the shaft, did her back up, she works perfect. Works freaking perfect, boys. Works, cuz, uh, yeah, where we go through uh, drill bits clearly. I snapped one off today. It was a uh, center drill, and I don't like doing that, because that's freaking terrible. I lost a freaking good eighth inch of my, of my material there, but, uh, any words? Got to see old crawdad there. 53 days off the cigarettes. Friggin' rights. Get a friggin' prehistory valve for that for sure. And we did a little bit of live patriotic stove piping and then we had to go because the truck, you know, the Mazda come up there. So friggin' rights. But the deal was it was free without the tires. But it's got a, you know, a year old battery into it and a friggin', you know what I mean? It's not even that bad of condition. I mean, I give Nelson a little how you doing, and I'm sure friggin' uh, sure it'll be uh, running fine. Maybe we'll just sell it, hey? Put it up for sale, fucking 2,500 bucks. We'll have it, but uh, yeah, the one I had before was five speed. That was pretty awesome. Sold it to tea bag and then ended up buying it back off him once he drove it for like five years or something, but, and still got the rims and tires off it, so, I was gonna put those on this one, this one, that, which said 200 bucks. It's like, well, they're totally worth 50 bucks a piece. Brand new friggin' snow tires. So I'll put them on Kijiji for 400 and double the monies before I even uh, sell the Ascol. And I got other tires to put on it if it sits in the yard. Hey, okay? and uh, yeah, so friggin' into that. But pretty well got these ready. I'm gonna put a set screw in the side of side of that guy and i'm just going to solder the ends of the wires we'll just like put you know some solder on there to make that like a solid guy obviously it'll be quite a bit shorter but uh yeah and then so they'll be just like you know one earth coal there and then i got like a you know we'll make a little pivot and then that will be decent similar situation to over here except for of course not quite as long and bulky but very much similar of the copy of the of the mechanism design type situation, right? So we'll just try to mimic that somewhat. And uh, yeah, it'll be awesome as frig. But it's how much or something. It's the latest frig. There's the, there's the grubs right there. Dirty old grubs. But uh, any words, it's friggin' latest frig. We got, uh, even on a friggin', on a mom's day, we friggin' uh, pulled her off, so that's friggin' awesome, but man, I gotta get on this truck, eh? Get this spot welder done, hopefully soon, man. And then, uh, I mean, you know, I'm just gotta do the rest of the floor and the inner rockers, toss the interior back together, but uh, yeah, I really wanna take it to Van Fest, so anybody any good at monkeying around in the shop, we got all type of fancy panters, if you wanna come play. Just let me know. Smoke a thousand cigarettes, work on the 83, but uh, any words, boys, friggin' uh, pre-story valve and the friggin' wide open factor. Let's get a thumbs up for Crawdad's non smoking. And if you missed him, a couple of bitches from earlier in the week, but I know it's boys, beg my pardon, they would cheat you to go another dirt park one pardon. Until tomorrow. Don't the watchers get you.